Hey guys, it's Jenna. I'm really nervous for this video today because let me just start by saying probably if you are under the age of 21, you probably shouldn't watch this video because I don't know what's gonna happen. I don't know, I'm really nervous. This is really weird. Something I never thought I would do and put on the internet ever, but here I am. So for those of you who don't know who I am, my name is Jenna and I'm 25 years old and I've legally been allowed to drink alcohol for four years now and I don't. I don't drink alcohol. I don't really like it. I've never really been to a bar or a club to like try different like cocktails and stuff so I don't even know what I would like if I did like anything. I thought you know, in my weird little brain that I have, that uh, I would try some homemade cocktails and see if I like any of them. And of course, film it because that's what I do. So sorry in advance if anything weird comes out of my mouth. And I do have little stickers on everything because this video is most definitely going to be demonetized because well, I don't even really have to say it. You already know. But we're gonna do our best to make sure it gets a slight bit monetization in there because uh, your girl needs to pay her bills. You know what I'm saying. But yeah, we're not promoting anything. You know, if you are under the age of 21, do not drink alcohol. It's not good for you. But I'm 25, so this is totally legal. And I am in the comfort of my own home. This is legal. Okay, kids? Okay, let's just dive right in, shall we? For the first drink, I'm going to make a mimosa because a lot of girls my age like to have brunch and when you go to brunch, you have mimosas. So I'm trying to see what the hoopla is about. I don't have a champagne glass because I don't drink alcohol. So I'm using this clear mug so we can see the cool effects as I pour it into this clear mug versus having a champagne flute because again, I don't have that because I don't drink alcohol. Ooh. Smell test. It smells like wine. And I know for a fact, I don't even know, do I do this first or OJ first? I don't know. Oops, was I not supposed to put ice in there? I don't even know. I didn't think about that. And I do know that people just kind of sprinkle a little bit or not sprinkle, that's not the word. Um, they just like do a little splash, that's the word. They splash it like, boop, okay, we're good. Mimosa time, but I don't think I can do that. I think I need more, so. Ooh, it does not smell good. It's giving me a headache already. Oh my gosh, this might not be a good idea. Okay, ready? Moment of truth, drink number one, the mimosa, which is just champagne and OJ, orange juice. Ooh, it's giving me the tingles all through my body. It's not bad. I don't love it, clearly. And I am going to be making what is called, although I've never like really drank before, I do know there's a game where people put all of their drinks in one cup and a loser has to drink that concoction if they lose the game. I don't really know. So I'm gonna be doing that, even though I'm not really playing a game, but I'm gonna mix all the drinks that I'm making today into this one cup and then take a sip of that at the end of this video. And that's gonna be really gross, I know. But you know what? We gotta make this video a little interesting, right? Okay, all right, on to drink number two. It is called a white Russian, which sounds really scary. And I am going to make that in this cup. Lola, are you drunk? Why are you dropping things? Oh, that smells so bad. Okay, this is a white Russian, so we need vodka. Ooh, this is not gonna be good. I just don't think I'm gonna like this. Cream, which seems really weird in alcohol, but I don't know. It smells like an old person. Here goes nothing. Ew, it's like curdling inside. I 
think, I don't know, that looks gross. Okay, here we go. It's not bad, but I could tell it's gonna make my stomach hurt. <laughs> that will F you up. Like, mentally and physically, like, oof. Okay guys, so it is New Year's Eve, by the way, that I'm filming this because I decided to do this video on New Year's because everybody goes out and gets crazy and drinks on New Year's, right? Duh. So yeah, it is, if you look, it's 11.58 on December 31st, which means we have to watch the ball drop at noon. I said noon. It's hitting me. At midnight, we're gonna watch the ball drop. But let's put a little bit in our cup. Oh God, that's gonna be bad. On to the next. Okay guys, it's 11.59. So we gotta watch the ball drop in three, two, one. That was the best I could do. And yes, it was a tennis ball, a giant one. I do feel a little bit lightheaded. I think this is what the kids call a buzz. A tequila sunrise. Because we all know. Tequila makes your clothes fall off. Some country song says tequila makes the girls clothes fall off. So it must be good. Let's try it. so bad. It literally smells like rubbing alcohol. Literally. This is gonna be fun. <coughs> that is so bad. And I've only smelt it. What am I gonna do? You're a big girl. Put your big girl panties on. Just take a drink. Okay, okay, we get this. <coughs> that was a bit dramatic. It's pretty bad. Okay, I'll try it again and try to be an adult about it, okay? <sighs> is there hair there? Because that is strong. Ooh. Seriously F you up. we're gonna make a mudslide cocktail. And I actually remember my mom making these when I was younger, or no, no. My mom made, it's called like a buttery nipple, which sounds really inappropriate. So never mind, scratch that thought. But mudslides I think are very popular. It doesn't smell so bad, but um, I'm nervous. There's three different types of alcohol in here and my stomach is hurting already. And my head is like, Whoa, that was like a really weird sensation. <laughs> it like hits you, and then the aftertaste is like really, really sweet and like creamy. I'm sorry, I know I'm like closing one eye a lot. I don't know why, but I'm just like, have that like sour pungent reaction to alcohol. I can't help it. Why did I decide to do this video? What is wrong with me? And I'm all by myself. Okay. I don't know about that one. I don't know. I don't know. All right. So now we are on to our last and final contestant. Apparently I'm calling my drinks contestants now, whatever. I'm going to be making a, like a hottie patati, something like that, a hot toddy. Hottie patati, hot toddy, hot toddy, I think. I don't know. But this one sounds the most delicious of them all. <laughs> Ooh. You can smell that whiskey though. Whiskey just makes me think of Brad Paisley and it just makes me want to sing. The angel sang a whiskey lullaby. La 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 <laughs> Ooh, that's weird. The warmth from the hot water it's nice, and the lemon is nice. It's not bad, um, but it's not good. Add her to the cup. 
Oh, oh, making a mess. Well, there you have it, folks. I tried uh, five mixed drinks, and what I learned was that I don't really like any of them, which is just slightly disappointing. There's one thing left that I have to do, and that is to try this disgusting concoction that I created. But before I try this, I do need to give out my video shout out. I'm losing my train of thought. And today's video shout out goes to Vivian. So shout out to you, girl. I talked to Vivian a little bit in the comments last video and Vivian seems like a really cool girl. So thank you for watching Vivian, wherever you are. I love you and I appreciate you. Yeah, that's all I had to say. All that's left to do now is try this disgusting concoction that I have created. It has like six different alcohols in it, a couple different juices in it, and dairy. Wow. Sounds delightful. Cheers to 2020 being a better year for me and for you because, I don't know, I'm totally losing my train of thought. <laughs> Honestly, I'm just avoiding drinking this by talking a lot and uh, I need to just get it over with. I don't, I don't know, I'm talking out of my ass now and my cats are freaking going crazy over there. Can you hear them? Like, it's midnight and they're chasing each other. Like, what are you doing with your life? Get to the point, Jenna. Drink your damn drink. I don't want to, I don't want to, I don't want to. Okay. gonna be gross. It's gonna be gross. Like we all know it's gonna be gross, right? Like you know it's gonna be gross. But the people need to know if it really is gross. Do you really need to know? I mean, we already know it's gonna be gross. Okay, you wanna know, so I'll give you that. Okay, let's go. Wait a minute. That was bad. I just burped and it was like not good. But this, let me, let me, let me, let me go back in for a minute. I'll be right back. Let me, let me just try again. I don't know what it is, but it's not that bad. Maybe it's in my mind. I don't know what's happening. Dare me to drink all this because I'm going to. Ready? Oh, this is gonna be so bad. I don't know what I'm gonna do. Oh. It almost came up. I can't. <coughs> that was not a good feeling. Not a good feeling. I'm gonna go do nothing, basically, because that's what I do. But this is my first video of 2020. Oh my God, look, she's going crazy. And it's midnight. <sighs> I don't know what I'm saying. Uh, what am I saying? Hmm. Uh, what's my th um? That's it for this week's video. So I will see you guys all next week for next week's video, which I think is gonna be a good one, and you guys are gonna like it. Love you. Bye. One hour later. Where's my cat? Frinky. Frinky bean. Let's go get Frinky. Frinky. No, don't leave. Don't leave. Oh. oh. I just hit my foot. Frinky. Can I pick you up? Come here. No, don't run away from me, please. I love you. Don't go. She went under the bed. Frinky. How do I have four cats and none of them want me to hold them? I don't get it. Why can't they just love me like as much as I love them? You know, like it's really annoying that they just like don't let me love them. I'm gonna try and get her. Oh, oh Bella, Bella, come here. Bella, there's Bella. Bella, come here, come here, come here. Hi.
Oh my goodness, thank you. I know you're the best. This is why you're my favorite. Bella, give me a kiss. Give me a kiss. Bella, Bella, no, don't run. Give me a kiss. Mm. Oh, okay. That was a fail. Lola? Lola, you let me love you. Come here. Oh, this is my low. Oh, don't scratch my face. Mm. Love you. I love you. Mm. Oh, she hates me too. Since we're chatting here, maybe I should show you guys something that I did um, for Christmas for my lovely boyfriend, whom I love so much. If you guys don't know who he is, his name's Steven. He's so cute. We've been together for like six years now. But anyways, for Christmas, well, for anything, he's always like, don't get me anything. Like, I don't want anything. Like, you don't have to get me anything. But of course, like, I gotta get him something, you know? He really wanted me to paint him a painting. So I painted him the painting he wanted, and it was like a replica of some famous painter's painting. Is this even recording? Oh, it is. Okay. Uh, that would have been really weird. Gosh, why am I so out of breath? Oh my god. Jenna, you need to, like, gain some stamina in 2020. Like, get it together. Anyways, yeah, I painted him a painting. And as a joke, I gave him this painting. Here, let me switch the camera over. But I don't want you guys to see the real painting yet. Okay. So, there's my cat, Lola. There's Steven texting me way over there. And then Lola cleaning herself. And yeah, so I painted him this painting because I thought it was funny because it's our little family with, you know, I just thought it was funny. Um, and if you guys want to see his reaction, let me know down below and I'll post it on my Instagram because it was hilarious. And then of course, I did a real painting that he wanted, which was this. It's pretty badass. So yeah, I painted this really rad dolly painting and it's pretty crazy like look at all these little details and stuff can you see so oh okay maybe we'll just lay it down but yeah i just thought i would share that with you guys <clears throat> that your girl can kind of paint it's me and my fake dolly painting which when i did this i was like oh my god is this so illegal to like copy someone else's painting because this painting is like a famous painting like millions of dollars right but it's only illegal if you like try to sell it which obviously it's not like exactly the same thing so i couldn't resell it anyways if i wanted to i just thought i'd share that with you but now i think i'm gonna lay down because i'm feeling really tired Woo. okay 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 i don't know i'll see you guys next week bye